Hello everybody, fifth period and I are here deciding to make a video on multiplying with mixed numbers. Our first question we're going to look at is from number two on today's worksheet. Five and one fourth times four and two thirds. Now multiplying fractions ain't no problem. It's a top times a top and a bottom times a bottom. However, these fractions have whole numbers mixed in, so you cannot do tops and bottoms. You have to do the Texas two step to make an improper fraction that only has a numerator and a denominator. So multiplication comes first. Five times four is 20 plus one, 21 quarters or fourths times three times four is 12 plus two is 14 thirds. Now if I multiply these fractions out, it's going to be a pretty big number and then I have to reduce at the end. So we're going to use our handy dandy cross reducing to make our life a little easier. So look at the 21 and the 3. Class, what can those be divided by? 3. 3, good. Alright, 3 divided by 3 is 1 and 21 divided by 3 is, what is it? 7. Seven. Okay, now I'm looking at the 14 and the 4. They can both be divided by, what do y'all think? Two. two. Excellent. Four divided by two is two. What's 14 divided by two? Seven. Seven. Okay, now we have some smaller numbers. Top times the top. What's seven times seven? Forty-nine. Of course that's going to happen on my video. <laughs> What's the bottom times the bottom? Two. Two. Now we got 49 over 2. That is just a simple division problem. So move it up. 49 is the top dog and the top dog goes where? In the house. In the house. And the bottom dog goes outside. So 2 goes into 4 twice. 2 goes into 9 4 times. And that will give us 48. When I subtract, how much do I have left over? One. Take that one, put it over your outside two, and that is your fraction. Final answer, 24 and one half. Put a little bubble around it, make it look girly. Put some lightning in it, make it look manly. Hope this helps. Have a great day. It's still on.